Hey, what's up everyone? If you're new here, my name is Akin. I'm a data analyst working at a healthcare analytics company. Before this job, I worked in IT Audit at a big four accounting firm. In this video, I'm going to talk about the differences between IT Audit and data analysis. I'm also going to be comparing the two industries, public accounting and the IT industry. Just for reference, audit, IT audit, tax, and some advisory roles would be in public accounting in this case. Data analysis, data science, and some software engineering roles would be in the IT industry. So let's get right into the differences. The first difference I want to talk about is the work methodology in IT industry is different than in public accounting. For example, in IT, again, that would be roles like data analysts, data scientists, software engineers. Most teams use Agile approach to project management and for getting the work done. If you're not familiar with Agile or Agile in British English, it's an approach to projects where you break them up into several phases. There are sprint cycles that teams are using, usually two weeks, and daily scrum meetings where everybody gives their updates and talks about what they're working on and any issues they're having. I have not seen Agile being used in public accounting or any of the big four accounting firms. I guess it's not software development, so it makes sense. But my friends that only worked in Agile teams don't really understand how can a team work without daily stand-ups, sprints and stories slash tickets that are basically the tasks that each member is assigned to work on during the sprints. Having an Agile team is great for seeing the progress and completing the project. But I think it's also great for the employees because the tasks you're going to be working on are certain. There might be some ad hoc tasks that you would have to work on but you also document them in the sprint dashboard. In that sense, the work culture in IT is different than in public accounting, which is the next thing I want to talk about. Public accounting, specifically the big four accounting firms, are known for their workload and the busy season. So there's always work to do and they're not measured by sprints or the stories that you create. During busy season, I know I talked about this a lot, but you're expected to work 50, 60, even 70 hours per week, and it's the norm. So public accounting has a much different work culture than the IT industry. I have not worked as a management consultant, but I'm hearing it's a similar culture to public accounting, for example, the workload. Data analysis requires much more technical knowledge than IT audit or audit in general. For example, when you're starting out, you're expected to have some certain skills such as SQL, Excel, Tableau, even as an entry level hire. IT audit, on the other hand, barely have any technical requirements. You might get asked for some certifications, but it depends on your experience level. So your soft skills are a lot more important than the technical skills, especially when you're starting out as an entry level hire. As an IT auditor, obviously you're gonna be working with tools like Microsoft Excel and your firm's database application, but you can learn those on the job and they don't require a technical expertise. As a data analyst, on the other hand, you might be writing code and you're using tools that other people don't know about, unless they work with or study them. The last difference I want to talk about in this video is working remotely is a lot more common in IT industry than in public accounting. While the big four firm I used to work at gave its employees the option to be fully remote, but the most public accounting firms want their employees to be hybrid. I guess it makes sense because having an agile team makes it easier to work remotely. And like I mentioned in the first difference, Agile methodology is not very common in public accounting. So if you're planning to be working in public accounting, be prepared to work in a hybrid setting. So these are the four differences between public accounting and the IT industry. If you like this video, you can check my how I became a data analyst or what IT auditors do videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.